Hello Pisces, welcome to your love reading for January. Hope you are amazing. Happy New Year, beautiful. Hope you are great. So we are going to jump right into your love reading for January. Okay, so we're going to start off with romance cards first. Then we're getting to those archetype cards for personality and the tarot and a spirit message. Okay, okay. <laughs> Okay, Pisces, January in love. Love yourself first and this could be the one. Uh, I almost feel like you had to get over past energy. Um, it could be a person specifically or it could just be that, you know, someone hurt you in the past and you don't want to be hurt again. So you've closed yourself off or something like that. Uh, I feel like you're going to meet someone. Okay, and it's almost a surprise, you know, somebody that you really connect with. Okay, okay, and then we have mediator and shapeshifter. Let's see. Yeah, the key for you, Pisces, is to open yourself up and allow it to happen. Um, it's like you're talking yourself out of being happy or finding issues with this person. Um, you almost don't trust this person because of how you feel about them. They may be very optimistic as well or lighthearted in a way that you just don't understand why they're like that. <laughs> That's what it feels like. It feels like they kind of just go with the flow and they have like this happiness about them. Like they're not worried. And you're like, it's a red flag that they're not worried or something like that. Okay. But I do feel like you just don't trust them. And it's because you just don't, particularly trust love right now okay so we're gonna do thoughts on both sides so this may be you this may be you pick the side that resonates but um thoughts feelings and then the actions on both sides okay oh the tower yeah you're not sure how to feel you're not sure how to feel for sure. Yeah. You've had this reasoning or this mindset for quite some time and it kind of protected you or kept you safe. It's like your wall. Um, you know, eventually you have to let it down. You may not be ready at the moment, especially with the seven of wands. It's like you're not sure yet if it's worth your time or energy to 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 go in that direction, like to break down those walls or not. So. Yeah, this is a shock to the senses, these feelings that you're feeling. Um, it's almost like, are you going to change your mind? Are you going to work towards the love that you want? Mm, I feel like you need some time to think about it. It could be that also you're focusing on work as well, but... It's like you want to see what this person does or the kind of work they're going to put into it. I feel like Pisces, you're looking for a reason, you know, you're not just doing it for emotion and for love. You're like, I need a reason why I need I should trust this person or a reason why I should work on this for them. Um, they already have some indication that they like you, you know, they may have already told you. Um, they could have been watching you for a long time as well, but I feel like they know they got feelings for you. Yeah, they know they have feelings for you and they see a future. Um, so this is a person that already cares in their mind. They already have you in their mind's eye, you know, um, and they're just going with the flow until that happens. That's what it feels like, you know, but you're like, uh, Okay, now I know this person is watching me or they're interested. 
but I'm going to hesitantly be open to this person. Hesitantly. Okay, let's see feelings. <laughs> One of these cards were upside down. I'm trying to find it. Sorry. If you're wondering what I'm doing. There it is. Okay. Yeah, this... You're trying to trust... You want to trust fully before you come out of your, like, shell. Um, I feel like you're not confident, and that's what's making it hard. Plus, you've been through a lot emotionally with something. Yeah, you're definitely fighting this with the Five of Wands. Um, you're making this difficult. Not on purpose, it's more because of what has happened in the past. I feel like you just want to trust fully um, before you take the risk. But you really do want to take the risk. I feel like it's just who you are as a person. Like you want to go towards love, but you're really confused. This is like knowing that your emotions can get you in situations. So... But you know that in the past, it's caused issues. So there's a little bit of hesitancy there. But I feel like you do want to go towards it, Pisces. You know, like in your heart, you're feeling it. Um, which leads me to believe that eventually you will, if not now. But we'll see in your actions. On this side. Yeah, this person wants to be in a relationship with you. They... This has a vibe of, I want to heal with you. Um, and they're going to do what they can to do what is right. From this, from the knowledge pool that they have, they're going to try to do everything right. Because they feel like being with you is what's going to make them happy. Okay, they may also be getting a divorce as well from someone. They're trying to do what's right, though. I don't get any bad vibes from this person. They definitely want to do what is right. Okay, actions. Ooh, lots of major arcana. Mm, that will of fortune. Yeah, there's going to take some time to clear out some issues, but this person's trying to do what is right, okay? So there is going to be a little bit of time because I feel like this person has something that they're clearing up or dealing with, even though they know that they want to be with you, okay, in their mind. But I feel like they're prioritizing and moving things around so that can happen. You need to be patient here, okay, before you make any final decisions. I feel like this is a journey that you're about to go on with this person, so it is good that you're being hesitant. I feel like because you know that this person's dealing with something, you may not be fully clear with the seven of cups, but you can feel it, which is why you haven't taken that risk. Okay. Because your intuition's telling you like, wait, I don't want you to fully jump in because you may get hurt. But also at the same time, I feel like you're meant to be with each other. You just have to kind of go through this shift of whatever it is. Okay. For them, yeah, they're fully clear that you're the one. I have no doubts in my mind. Um, I feel like they're going to tell you sometime in January um, what their plans on or what they're going to do. I feel like they're just going to tell you exactly. They have this energy, Pisces, of like, I just want you to know everything so you can know where this is going. Very truthful energy um wanting stability like they're all about stability and like doing things right believe it or not um yeah and this is like the beginning of a journey I want to say but it does give me that feel like it's gonna be you're gonna be connected to this person for a while Spiritually answer the 
So this person may be calling you or contacting you. Answer the call. It's that simple. Okay. Um, it's that simple. Pick up, pick up the phone. There's a connection between you two. I'm about to get into this for a minute, Pisces. There is a connection between you two that is important in some way. Okay. Like this person is a part of your tribe. It could be a soulmate. Um, the next person that you're going to be with, they could teach you something, but this needs your attention, this relationship. Yes, it may be a little bit bumpy at first, but I feel like this journey, it's something about this where the universe is like calling you to, to connect with these cards. Okay. Um, yeah. And they can't ignore their connection with you. You know, um, they're clear that there is a drive towards you. I'll say that. They may not know why, but they definitely want that and they want to be happy and they want to be with you. They they may even want to marry you, you know? Um, but there's a sense of marriage here, whether it's with you or they have that with someone else, like they're trying to clear it up. Yeah, and it's like right now they can't dive into it and you would like that direct energy but also it's just kind of like, go with the flow, go with the flow, be patient, be compassionate, let this person clear up what they need to clear up because in their mind, you're it. I don't know how else to explain it. Okay. So Pisces, I love you so much. Happy new year again. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.